Hey, what's up guys? This is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Sartuche, and I've got a Pin International 30 VISW that I have spooled up for a customer with the 80 pound of the Cortland brand 16 strand. The only bad thing is when I was going through, I accidentally deleted the video, so I don't know how much is on here. It was a day I did like 15 reels back to back to back, so now I've got to strip it down, re-spool it so I can get the line capacity on there. Got a lot of stress on my mind. It's a nice day to go. Yeah, I got a line. I'm a caller, the whole team. Normally, I have it written down, but I only have where I did the 100 pound test of the 12 strand. So I need to redo this one. And yeah, it's going to set me back a little bit in time, but it's something I got to do because I'm definitely. We'll keep track of where I write it down and stuff like that. So I will keep our library growing. Well, the good thing is I already have a knot tied, so all I gotta do is start spooling once I get the configuration set up.
All right, guys, so there's 100 yards of the 16-strand Cortland on this reel, and we're going to keep it going. And we got a little bit of the coloring slipping off my fingers and getting back on the spool, but that ain't going to hurt anything, so we're good to go. All right, guys, that's 200 yards of the 16 strand. Now I'm gonna stop every 200 yards from there on out. All right, guys, so we're at 400 yards and we're just underneath the first bevel right there. So I'll stop there though, just so that way we know we're hitting the bevel marks too. <laughs> All right, so the first bevel's covered up and I'm at 450 yards. At 600 yards, and we're about halfway up to the next bevel, so we'll keep it rolling. 16 strand, 80 pound test. Okay, 
that's 800 yards and we're just shy of the bevel so we'll again stop at the bevel and see where we're at All right guys, so we just covered up that bevel and I'm at 895 yards at the 16 strand, 80 pound Cortland braid of the Holocord. So yes sir, gonna keep it rocking and rolling until we get to the end. That's a thousand yards and we're about halfway up to the bevel, so yeah, looking really good. What's that? You do have a 30. Uh, I had a question about your 30s and your 50s, man. Uh, what you use to use with them as far as, I know you do some shark fishing with them, but I mean, what would you recommend? I'm, this is going to be my first shark reel. Mm. And I really want to get into it, but I don't want to buy a reel and then uh, be like, oh shit, I should have just gotten the next one, the bigger size, you know what I mean? Then that would uh, be the 80. The 80. So that's what my question was. If, 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 uh, I should start with a 30, a 50, or an, or an 80. 80 all the way. The reason, the, way. the reason being because the 80 can do everything the 30 and the 50 do, can I do, but you. not vice versa. vice versa. And then you get cut off with the 80, you still got plenty of line to keep running the reel. I got you. The other way, you, you, you know, oh, I can run it, but I got to do this, and I got to do, and you got to keep holding yourself back. Yeah. And now, granted, the 50 has landed some monsters, but they caught it up close, and, you know, it's really by chance. Yeah. The 80, you can reach out and touch, you know what I mean? So, so it, on those 80s, are these row seats are specifically meant for different type of row seats? Or, I mean, the, the bottom seat? The real foot? Yeah, the foot itself. Is it specifically for certain rods, or, or is there a certain real seat that it, it, it can sit on? No, no. They, I've put them on. I've interchanged my, my 80s between all my rods. I got you. They, they work just fine. Okay. And as far as line wise, what do you usually put? 130 pounds? 130. 130 straight? Yeah. Yeah, just because it's the cheapest way to do it and still get great line capacity. I got you. What are your 80s running? Uh, 749. 749. And, I, and I think I only have one left. The blue? Yeah, we had five of them on Friday and we sold out, almost sold out on Saturday. I'm ordering more, but. There. Waiting on the email that they got them in and, and are confirmed. So, yeah. Cool. Well, you, you answered my questions, man, and I'll just keep an eye out. Uh, I'd rather go through you than, than anybody else, you know what I mean? Mm. I'll keep an eye out and see what you get in. I'm really after a purple one. Well, like I said, I can place the order for it. They get they had a purple the last time. They did? Uh, but um, I got to check my pre orders right now, and if there's an order for one, I'm going to order two, you know yeah. what I mean? But if somebody else comes in, hey, I want a purple one, and I've already got two on order, well, then the second one will be sold before they yeah. even get here. Yeah. And, and that has happened, so 
That's why I'd rather know so that way I can try to order at least one more so I'm not, I have them in stock, you know. And uh, you would know more or less, I know it's out of your hands, but you would know more or less as far as you getting your answers. Uh, I'd have to stop be, and check emails. It won't be like a month, two months. No, like that, no, right? no, no. No, I, I, I asked today, I'll have an answer in about 30, 40 minutes when I can stop and get on my phone again. Can you give me the total? For a real, real width line? Uh, uh, real just a real for now and then a big plate. Big plate. Okay. Yeah. And then get a harness system that you can sit in that it comes across your lower back and butt. Um, don't do the lower back one. Uh, Black Widow was a good one. Uh, Braid has a really good one, the Brute Force, the Brute Max, something like that. Okay. Um, those, there's, there's a couple more. I just, I got to check the names and stuff like that. Okay. So, but all right, guys. So we're at 1,277 yards. I still got a little bit of room here, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish it off because obviously I got to get all the braid back on there and see where we're at. And there we go. We're at 1,400 yards of 80 pound, 16 strand on this International 30. So very, very nice. In comparison to the regular two speed ones, yeah, it would be a T-Rex. That is so beautiful. Look at the gap on there. Nice gap itch all the way across. So very nice. 1,400 yards of 80 on there.